the energy vibration readings for the sun, moon, and rising cancers for the second week of um, October 2017. This week has the energy vibration from water, so this is going to be good for you guys. And the zodiac energies is going to be um, um, air. So, okay, let's look at your week. Your week, the eye princess is here. Um, it is saying, um, listen to your intuition, whatever the situation is. Listen to your intuition, and um, it's going to be positive. Um, the crowning of the week is going to be a new beginning, or whatever that is going to be. is a new beginning in your financial situation and in things around you. On Monday, the energy of the tower is going to break down. On Tuesday, yourself is here. Let's see what is happening with especially the men, the cancer's men. On Wednesday, new beginning. And as we look at the Thursday, we have the energy of the four of um, pentacles. On Friday, we have the six of ones. Good news, positive good news. And another six. So number six is going to be the energy vibration reading for you in this week. Uh, we have another six, the six of swords in reverse. This is good. So it's the end of a journey or a situation. And on Sunday, we have the energy of the lovers. So this is going to be wonderful. Um, let's look and see what is happening with the towers for you guys. The towers is a breakup for some people. Hold on. Let me look. There is a lot of new beginnings. You're going on a new journey. There is going to be a celebration connection of people. You'll be going out on Friday. This is going to be wonderful for a lot of people. Okay, the tower and the sun. This is wonderful. Whatever that was blocking you from whatever you were trying to achieve in your life, the tower has come. So whatever that was blocking you, you um, as you look at this, and I love using these cards because it's the Cosmo, the Cosmo um, Tower card deck, and it's so positive because the energy of the highs of the source creator is looking down to see whatever that has been happening to you and in your life, and it is a breaking down whatever that was blocking you, and that um, hat. Um, that is falling because as you can look it's a hat that is falling and when you look in this card deck the um, energy of the fire sign the king of ones that's the person who wear that hat so whatever that has been happening is a, a breakdown of a certain situation whatever that was built on lie will be broken down and this is what the universal angels and guides have done and you can see that with the tower the falling the sun is coming out, okay? So this is good for you, Kansas, on Monday. On Tuesday, on Tuesday, we have your own energy vibration on Tuesday, which is wonderful. This is going to affect them, the men and the women out there, and some of you are going to be on a new journey. So whatever has been happening, this is going to be positive, and it could be a new journey um, with your emotional... Um, Let's say that you have been going through an emotional roller coaster because that was in the reading for the first week that you, uh, you know, really wanted to protect your heart and that sort of a thing, and you were on an emotional roller coaster, and now you're, you, you know, you're over that and you're going on a new part in your life, and maybe this is wise and this is good. Okay, so whatever that was blocking you on Monday, whatever that was affecting you, um, that it's going to be over on on Tuesday. Uh, you're going to begin a new. And you're going to be on a new journey so it can affect the people in a lot of ways it can be different things that is affecting your life as I had said before um, the energy vibration is fire and it is uh, um, the prominent sector and this is a new beginning again so a second new beginning a lot of people are going to be venturing out in new uh, ventures um, new business partners new um, work situations that sort of a thing it's going to be a positive week for you cancers because it's all a week of new beginnings so whatever that was holding you back has broken down in the front of in the first half of the first of the week which is Monday and you are going to see new changes new challenges that is coming in and this is going to be a very very positive as we move on and we look at Thursday Thursday we have the energy vibration of the four of Pentacles whatever this energy of the four of Pentacles is 
on uh, Thursday, it's going to be good because you have the King of Sword. Whatever is happening with uh, the, the balancing of the, the Four of Pentacles is balancing your financial situation. You have the King of Swords. You know, um, I would say to you, whatever the situation is, you know, no matter what is happening, just you know, ignore this person because this King of Sword, whatever is is uh, uh, situation behind this. Uh, you know, let it go because he, he, you know, this person has been what I'm getting from this person because this person is an Aries, uh, a Gemini, or a Libra. This person is an Aries, a Gemini, or a Libra. Be, a, be, be aware of this person and just, you know, let it go because, um, if people try to be dishonest to you, it's only going to come back to them. So, whatever that is happening, you know, if somebody, um, do not want to pay you something and somebody are putting a block on your finance which is saying in the sense that you don't want to they don't want to pay you something okay know that someone else is going to come up and take twice or four times that amount that they don't want to pay you okay this person is a very sad person sick sad person let them go as we move on on friday we have the energy vibration of the six of ones which is a positive energy and good news is going to come in on Friday and there's going to be a celebration. So whatever is happening, positive energies, good news are coming in on Friday. There's going to be a wonderful celebration. So this is good. Remember that the energy of the number six on Saturday is a wonderful day because you have come to the end of a journey of a situation in your life. Whatever the situation is, um, you know, be thankful that you have actually come to this journey and move on without looking back. The world is about to open up for you and this is going to be positive in a wonderful way. As we move on, we have the Two of Cups. So we're ending Sunday with a wonderful energies of the Two of Cups. There's going to be a connection. You're going to connect connect with someone who um, um, is, and for some people, it's a new someone new is coming in your life that you're going to be very attracted to, that you're going to be connected to someone who there is deep love and affection. Um, there is the energy vibration of the Knight of Swords, and this person seems to be. Um, coming between you both this person seems to be standing between you both but whatever is happening is that this person is not going to have an effect on it okay because um, there is it is written in the star or in your blueprint who will be the winner of this thing so um, here comes the knight so we had the king of swords and the knight of swords the knight of swords is someone with 18 between 18 and 35 and has the energy vibration of um, 18 and 35 and have the energy vibration of uh, um, the Aquarius the Gemini or the Libran okay and I'm seeing the connection with the King of Swords because it's something about financial. So maybe this knight knows the King of Swords. Maybe he was the one who has sent him to receive whatever information, whatever that is. You know, when people are liars and people, you know, try to uh, do things, you know, this this credible things, whatever way it happened, you know, um, whatever people try to do, you know. Um, let them be um, take things as it goes um, there's going to be a, a, a new beginning the knight of wands is going to open up new doors and possibilities for you knight of wands is the energy vibration of a hair is it uh, um, uh, uh, Aries a Leo or a Sagittarius and this person is going to open up doors of opportunities for you a lot of you men are going to be on a new journey maybe you have met someone maybe um, you had an, a sort of a heartbreak um, you were thinking about something and you feel lost this is going to change around for you in this week because it was and if you go back and listen to your monthly readings you you will see that the first week for you in the in love wasn't that good because you were trying to protect your heart but somehow that didn't work out there's going to be a new start a new beginning the sun and the world is together in the first half of the week so whatever that was blocking you from connecting with whoever you were trying to connect in or connecting with whatever you were trying to achieve in your life it's the tower came and broke that down and it is going to be okay whoever that this 
um, king of sword is and this knight of swords the king of sword can always be someone who is espionage and the knight of swords also okay so the king of swords and knights of swords could be working together but at the end of the day good news is going to become uh, good news is going to be coming in for you there's going to be a celebration there's going to be a happy ending there's going to be new beginnings so this week I'm using the energy vibration of uh, the unicorns I love the unicorns whatever is the energy vibration um, we are going to see what the unicorns has for the cancers in this week and it says a, a new beginning and this is good because you have the fool twice and um, this is wonderful because you have the fool the number three is going to be your energies um, and the number six because and the future number 11 let go of the past and move on to a positive future so this is going to be um, wonderful so whatever is the past whatever is happening in the past let go of the past and look for a positive future and I want to say thank you for being here namaste until next week